Yo, what is good, everybody? Welcome back. Hopefully, you guys are having an awesome day of only positive vibes. Guys, you've asked for a turret tier list, and today that is this video. So I've actually used every single turret in the game, and I can pretty confidently say which one is the worst and which one is the best. So we're gonna be specifically ranking the eight final turrets. These eight turrets include the heavy sentry turret, the cannon turret, the laser turret, the thunder turret, the double grenade turret, the missile turret, the fire grenade turret, and finally the tar turret. And depending on which one you're trying to upgrade, you will require some aether, you will require some pedestal level. Level two, and then depending on which one you're trying to upgrade, you're gonna need some grenade mods, some machine gun mod, some flame mods, or some laser mods. All right, to start off our list at number eight, it is the tar grenade turret. This is by far the worst turret in the game to the point where Call of Duty Mobile actually lowered the amount of turrets required for the mission. It used to be 30, now it's only 20 because literally nobody was making them. Now, on paper, this seems like a very good turret. It slows, it has long range, it actually shoots at medium speed, and you can deal extra burning damage. However, the range is actually not that long. It's probably like borderline long to medium. And honestly, they should add another range to like very long because some of these other turrets will shoot pretty dang far. And yes, it does slow, but it's not as great as some of these other turrets. And yes, you can deal more burning damage that really only works with the fire grenade. And finally, this requires a flame mod, which is an epic mod, which requires usually day four or five to unlock. So you can't really unlock this super early and it requires more resources. So honestly, not the best one and that's why it's number eight. Number seven, the double grenade turret. Yes, this is one of the basic ones and it only requires grenade mod to use. However, it is not that great, especially when you consider the upgrade you could have taken instead of the double grenade mod. It does deal decent damage, but overall, I don't think it's worth it to make this, especially since it doesn't have a great fire rate. It does have good range and the damage is okay. Like it's pretty strong, but if you compare it to the other upgrade, literally the other upgrade of this is substantially better and that's why I have this at number seven. Number six, is gonna be the fire grenade turret yes some people might think this is seven but the fire can be very very useful it does actually do aoe damage and it deals more damage which is okay at best but the downside about this it does require flame mods and honestly any of the flame turrets are pretty bad it does have very good range it is basically the grenade turret but with fire which i think is still pretty good but honestly i'm not a huge fan of grenade mods or any of those grenade turrets except for one specifically which will be down the list but we'll talk about that after but that's why this is my number six Number five is gonna be the heavy turret mod. This is gonna be number five. It has great rate of fire, shoots absolutely super fast. It has medium range and the damage is fantastic. It is also the lower tier, so it actually requires a little bit less when it comes to resources in comparison to all the other ones. However, there's an upgrade that you could have picked instead of this, which is higher up the list, which I find is substantially better. And there's no reason for you to make this if you can make the other one, because the other one will absolutely shred. But for those reasons, that is why it is number five. Number four is gonna be the laser turret. I've actually had a little bit of a hard time trying to figure out my top four because a lot of these are actually really good. And generally speaking, I actually use all four of these in the same build. But as you guys can see, the laser turret is my favorite. And the reason it's lower down below is because it requires laser mods. And laser mods, again, is epic or purple ones and are a little bit hard to find however this does a lot of good stuff it slows it does a lot of damage and extra damage to elite mobs so any of those elite mobs that you can be fighting against it's going to deal a lot of damage and it has long range and the rate of fire is medium so that will laser and shred all those elite mobs so if you ever have any problems dealing with kind of like the um the the heavy gunners or the pulverizer this will help out the reason i didn't put this higher up on the list because again the upgrade of this i think is specifically better for killing some of the bigger mobs and you guys will understand when i explain but for those reasons that is my number four all right number three is going to be the cannon turret this might come to a shock to you guys because number three Three and two, in my opinion, were very, very close. Some of you guys might have put this even higher, but personally speaking, I like this where this is at, but it was still very close with number two. Now, compared to its brother, the Heavy Sentry Turret, this is a substantially better gun. It has about the same range, maybe a little bit shorter than the other one, but the rate of fire is the fastest of any other turrets. And not only that, it deals more damage to elite zombies, as well as it deals increased damage in general. It is absolutely a monster when it comes to shredding. Look. When you shoot wardens, usually it takes you forever, but this turret will kill wardens like nobody's business as well as the elite gunner. Now there is one downside, the range is super short, so make sure to move the turrets a little bit closer and that way you can beam everyone. But that is why it's my number three. And number two is gonna be the thunder turret. Look, a lot of you guys might have put this in number three and I understand it does require the lightning mod, but there is a very important part in this. It increases penetration damage and reduces their HP. The increased penetration is huge because there's a lot of zombies that will suddenly 
definitely get a lot of armor and this will just go through the armor and deal a lot of damage and it also has the longest range of any of the other non-missile ones because actually the next one on top the first number one which i'm sure you guys can predict has crazy range but this one has absolutely insane range it does have low rate of fire but it has high damage and the added bonus it does immobilize while using aoe so you can actually stun a lot of zombies so you don't have to worry as much and it has great range and that is the reason why i put this at my number two and finally number one is going to be the missile turret i'm sure a lot of you guys guessed the missile turret and there's a lot of reason why this is the best turret in the game first and foremost this does not require any epic resource so you don't need a flame mod or a laser mod and grenade mods are super easy to find and you can find them literally from the beginning of the game and it is fantastic it also deals a lot of damage and it shoots multiple missiles with insane range you can literally put this in your base and you will see the missile fly up in the air and shoot down mobs it is aoe basically and it does so much damage i literally did a game with four missile turrets and absolutely popped off it is so good it has great damage and honestly it was pretty close in my opinion the top fours are all you know turrets that you can use but the missile turret just because it doesn't require as much resources you can actually make them super easily and still focus on grinding on your camels makes my missile turret number one all right that's it for today hopefully you guys enjoyed the video if you did like share and subscribe let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about my list do you agree disagree and if you disagree let me know what is your list or just let me know your top turret honestly i think the missile turret is really really good but it's really close but let me know all right i'm out see you guys next time kill it